Hey folks, today we've got the five most powerful nuclear explosions that have ever occurred on Earth. Let's go. Number five, the Castle Yankee was the second most powerful bomb in the US military's Castle series. She was detonated on May 4th, 1954 and had an explosive yield of 13.5 megatons. Four days later, the so-called fallout, which is the radioactive rainfall, eventually reached Mexico City, which is 2,700 kilometers away. Number four, the strongest US American atom bomb was also from the Castle series. Its name was Castle Bravo. On February 8, 1954, they detonated the 15 megaton bomb, triggering the US's largest thermonuclear explosion. The mushroom cloud reached a height of 35 kilometers and was even stronger than expected. This wrong calculation also meant that 665 residents of the Marshall Islands were accidentally contaminated. In addition, a fisherman died who was located 129 kilometers away. Number 3. In August and September 1962, the Soviet Union conducted several nuclear tests. Tests 173, 174, and 147 were the fifth, fourth, and third most powerful nuclear explosions ever to have shaken our planet. All three bombs had an explosive charge of 20 megatons. Number 2. The Soviet nuclear test 219 was carried out on the 24th of December 1962. The bomb had an explosive yield of 24.2 megatons and thus caused the second largest explosion on our planet. With its 24 megatons, she was only half as strong as the strongest bomb of all time, and thus we come to that. Number 1. On October 30th, 1961, the USSR detonated the strongest hydrogen bomb ever. The bomb was designed for an explosive yield of 100 megatons, but was fired for testing purposes only with an explosive charge of 58 megatons. So that means it was twice as large as the second largest bomb, and 4,000 times as large as that of the Hiroshima bomb. The bomb was dropped from an altitude of 10,500 meters. After the explosion, the blast was so great that it almost crashed the bomber which had dropped it. The mushroom cloud grew to a height of 64 kilometers. With a blast radius of 55 kilometers, it brought everything to the ground, and even at 270 kilometers distance, you could still feel the heat. Despite its enormous destructive power, the so-called ZAR bomb was one of the cleanest ever nuclear weapons produced, since the radioactive pollution was reduced to a minimum. Well folks, I for one am glad that testing such bombs hasn't happened for nearly 50 years, and hopefully we don't ever need to see that happen again. If you like this video, why not check out another one here, or subscribe to our channel for more. Until next time, bye!